Hey guys, this is Kyle with uh, ServerComp, uh, your computer tech guy. So I was trying, t I ordered uh, this uh, USB HD TV cable uh, plug and play from Amazon. I think it was about 21 bucks. It's kind of pricey. So I bought this and this is what it looks like. The cord has an HDMI plug and then at the end it also can plug uh, hold on a second. It also can plug a USB uh, C. I don't know if you could see that, which is the round one, which is like can go backwards and stuff. And then the normal uh, micro uh, SD, which I don't think you could see either. But I like this because you can actually do both. Because I actually have devices that require <coughs> uh, micro USB. And my newer Android phone, uh, uh, USB C. So basically, it wasn't as easy as I thought. I tried to plug it in. Uh, I put the HDMI plug in in the back. As you can see, I don't know if you can see that. So I plugged it in here. And apparently, I guess it runs, you need to actually plug it in, uh, you need to plug this uh, USB, apparently it's a, a power source, so that has to be, that has to be uh, plugged in, and luckily I have one in the back of my TV too, so I put that in. And then the problem was, I wasn't seeing anything, it just shown. It just shown this uh, mirror cast uh, thing, see? If you, and you also gotta make sure to put on the right HDMI. So mine's on HDMI one, so make sure you do that. So I don't know what the heck was going on. But anyway, I looked on the website uh, where I bought it and apparently it claims you can use Google Home app or Chrome uh, cast, which apparently is the best choice, the Android ADP mirror, and EasyCast app mirror. So in the end, when I try to plug it into my phone, it wasn't working for some reason. And the fact was, I simply didn't have the correct app for it. So I'll do it on my tablet since you can actually see it a little better. But you gotta type in, go to uh, Chrome, or I mean go to the Play Store for Android phones, and you just type in Mira Mira Plug. And I end up doing that, and of course you just install it, and then you can open it. See, if you look at my options too, I don't have I don't have a screen mirror an option. I even tried the the smart view which doesn't work with this type of TV but it works for my dad's big one but I can't use it since he's usually using it and it's not uh, productive so that's why I had to actually buy the actual cord for it so anyway once you install this thing this is what actually help it's apparently even though this thing's called uh, uh, what's it called it's just called a, a USB is this called the USB HD TV cable and it has mirror screen on it so the, basically you need to download the app and it'll look like this and you just plug it in like so let me put the camera down here and you could use the knob I, I like this because it could transform both that's what I want because I, I have both devices so I plug that in and it's going to say slow charging because it's not the USB uh, isn't uh, the correct USB. So you gotta open mirror plug when the USB accessory is connected. So yes. Okay. It might have you turn off power settings. So I have that. So mirror uh, plug will start mirroring the screen. And there it is. So I'll show you. So I'm doing that. And I'll go into a game if I can here without it falling. I don't know if it's gonna work. So I could do this and put 
this down. So see, there you go. Now it's it's mirroring it, and I'll see if I could play my my favorite dual links, which my brother loves. He thinks it's a horrible baby game, but I disagree. I just upgraded my my cards again to this spellcaster deck using the the Kintet Magician, powerful magician, and all that. And using the Dark Magician kind of stuff, but I keep losing, so I don't know, I gotta figure it out. Anyway, see, yep, it's working. And you also can uh, put Bluetooth to the actual uh, Amazon uh, Dot, Echo Dot, too, which I put the sound with. And just to prove it, it works. Pretty cool, it's a pretty handy device, and I'm pretty sure. I always wanted to wonder how the heck people plug in their stuff. And I guess now it does work. Most people use Chromecast, which is another dongle device uh, that they could plug it in and just download the app, which I try to use Chromecast, but it didn't sense it. So uh, I don't even know why it has that Google Home app, uh, those instructions, which are incorrect on the website. So I didn't even know what the heck was going on. So all these devices will connect with it. It's a pretty good device. I guess I recommend it. Perhaps buying a Google Chromecast would be a little bit easier, but I just like the fact that it it's, comes with a double uh, USB-C micro USB cord, and, and you can just pretty much play whatever. And I like it, and I recommend it. All right, this is Kyle with Server Comp signing off. Take care.